Well, Ella, churches here in Newport continue to provide a lifeline for thousands of families in Cosby, Newport, as well as Cock County. The water supply was knocked offline last Friday during the hurricane. Yesterday, it was restored. They have running water today, but when the folks here realized that there was a need, the churches filled that void. We'll come back if you need more. Awesome. Thank you, ladies. You're I welcome. really appreciate it. You are welcome. Lincoln Avenue Baptist Church is filling a need never before experienced in Newport. As soon as its parking lot opened last Sunday to receive people who needed help, they came. You're not a member of the church? No. no. Yet here they are helping you. Exactly. Exactly. No questions asked. I am amazed and I'm so pleased to see that the, the community has come and pulled together so quickly. Rags, masks, cleaning supplies, all that fun stuff. At Newport's First United Methodist Church, volunteers continue to load supplies for families who have been without necessities since Friday night. We come to get some water and a few uh, cleaning supplies, maybe some diapers. How short are you on these supplies? Very short. Trailers full of paper products, water, and food have arrived from as far away as Middle Tennessee. Considering the circumstances that we're under, um, we have just been blessed the last few days with East Tennesseans and uh, God's grace just pouring in right now, giving us the supplies that we need to try to get to people as fast as we can. Now, Newport's big food pantry, it was flooded Friday night. Everything was lost. So churches like First Methodist and Lincoln Avenue, they're there to help those in need, and they'll continue to be here through this weekend, probably next week, and maybe beyond. Bo? Don, thank you. Again, neighbors helping neighbors, that is for sure. Don and Ella, again, thank you very much.